like I don't. You're talking about this one, right? Yeah. Yeah. Was it this one you're talking about? Yeah. But I don't know either. Oh, man. See, I told you, that's why I didn't want to start chopping, because as soon as that big one came down, it looks different. See, like... Now it looks like there's a lot more branching down. Yeah. See, that looks pretty good. Unless you want to go higher. Because of these rollers right there. Yeah, you want to go higher. Yeah, so... I didn't want to cut this between okay. So this one? Yeah. Like right here? Yeah, yeah. Uh, this one? Yeah. Or what do you think? Because it's kind of in your face right yeah, here. Yeah, that goes out way too much. Okay. Yeah. So this one, this one. I don't want to cut this one right here. This curve in there. Because oh, no, no. you want that shape, right? Yeah, that looks good. Uh, this one right here? Yeah, the hang ones that hang low, yeah. So anything like in my face? Exactly. Pretty much? Okay. Is that yeah. six feet or six foot? Yeah. yeah. So this one, would it be silly to cut this one? Uh, yeah, that one, that one, exactly. This one right here? So that one, we're going to leave this big one, trust me, you don't, it's going to look funny if we cut this big one off. Yeah, yeah, I think we do the ones. I think the one, we do the ones that you're holding down. I'm sorry. The ones you're holding down. I think we do those ones. The ones that you just had your hands oh, on. Oh, okay. The ones that are, you're holding. Okay, in. so I got to cut it at the Y. Yeah. But then if I cut that there, yeah, we're gonna leave that. So anything that hits, basically anything that hits you. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah. Yeah, I just like that. I don't know, I would leave this. You would, right? I think so. Let me trim those ones okay. and then we're gonna look at this one. Sounds here. good. Yeah. Okay. Makes a big difference when you do it and you oh, actually yeah. you actually see what it so looks I told like. You. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. A little bit of a tree trim there. I did have a lot more footage, um, but like I said, my camera battery died. <laughs> I had no idea. I had really cool uh, different angles and, and stuff. So anyway, um, I'm on a property here just walking around. I'm doing an estimate. This is a, a totally different property now um, for a spring cleanup. As you can see, all the gardens going around there. They're a little messy, neglected. These people just moved in. Um, not too uh, long ago I think over the winter right so now that the snow has all melted and everything we can kind of see what's going on here with the lawn and everything so uh, yeah I'm just doing an estimate for a cleanup uh, grass cutting too and uh, you know re-edging the gardens possibly some mulch also snow removal for uh, yeah we're already talking about snow removal for for next winter <laughs> So yeah, see it needs to be all cleaned up down the side here. That's not a problem at all. Blow it all out. So looking for uh, uh, snow removal at the same time here. It is a bit of a pain because you got to come down here. It's on a busy road. I have a couple other ones on this road too and it's really hard uh, when there's traffic on the road. So I'd have to come up here. Where am I going to put the snow? Maybe off to the right? I don't know. But uh, yeah, I need some clean up there. It needs a lot of clean up around here. So oh, that's not too hard. So like I said, I'm looking at the snow removal part too. Are those cars going to stay there in the winter time too? I don't know. Maybe I can push them up in that garden there to the right of this Nissan or, or left, the driver's side. Yeah, I'll use a trimmer and just cut all that away. Well, the cleanup's not too bad. Pretty straightforward. Just kind of rake that out, blow it out. I don't know what's going on back there but this is where I'm thinking about pushing the snow to down that laneway but it's tight back here too to turn around because uh, when I first showed up here I came to the back and my only way out was either to back all the way down and be blind and not see the traffic or try and turn around and I barely had enough room to turn my truck around and that's without a plow on it and a salter on the back so it's going to be even more well much longer right so yeah as you can see it needs a lot of clean up here 
So, uh, yeah, the cleanup's not too bad. I'm just not sure about the snow removal, and I already told him about that. That uh, I'm just a little concerned. Where are we going to put the snow? Uh, having another look around here. Yeah, I don't know. I can do it. It might not be perfect. You know, I got to back drag away from that garage and then pull it to the right and keep on going like that. I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't like these tight ones like this when there's not a lot of room to turn and uh, not a lot of room for snow and stuff. So that's pretty much it. So I'm going to give this one a quote and uh, or give them a price and see what happens.